Welcome to the Newgrounds Podcast. Today's episode hosted by Will Comer, Psycho Goldfish, Zinzinix, Goodell, and Voices by Corey. Welcome, everybody. It's time. The year is over. <laughs> We're all very excited. We did yeah. it. We live. It's about damn time. I have butterflies. Uh, <laughs> guys, this is the last show of the year. It is 12 29 2020. We're all circling around the campfire. Campfire? Fireplace. I'm changing my uh, <laughs> fiction. We're around the fireplace. Just here to share some memories and some joy of a year that was just full of joy. Um, Great year. Yeah. yeah, the opposite of joy. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> and by joy, I mean unending terror and panic. Uh, we got all five of us here. Uh, Will Zinn, Psycho Goldfish, <laughs> Goodell, Gross, and Corey. Hi, guys. <laughs> Hi, Hi, Will. Hi, Will. Hi, Will. Hi, Will. Happy New Year, everybody. Hello. Is this an AA meeting? Um, I shouldn't be drinking right now. <laughs> this is AA. Well, cheers, bro. I'll drink to that. We can all cheers, drink to that. Cheers. cheers. When you guys joined this podcast, whenever that would have been, did you realize maybe we would have been here this long? How long has it been? Like eight, ten months now? Fucking all of COVID. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah, that's when that, I met that's you guys. That's forever. See, mm-hmm. that's the thing, though. Like, yeah, it's been almost a year, but it was the COVID year, so it's it's actually like six years. Yeah. 40, 40 yeah, years. Yeah, it feels long. Or three it's weeks, been 40 depending years on what day it is. We're on season 20 of the mm-hmm. New Grounds podcast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're sponsored by Squarespace at this point. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Josh is 60 years old now. He wasn't mm-hmm. when he started. <laughs> no. He was 58. <laughs> to be fair, he did age uh, a lot during the same time. Geriatric goldfish. I, I That's did. I did. I have a pacemaker now and everything. <laughs> Corey, you're the newest host. Welcome. Are you going to... Uh, are you going to do anything special because you're the, the newest host? I don't know. I didn't have anything lined dance. up, but if you want dance me to do something us. special, I can. Dance, yes. I, I mean, I don't think that would be, you know, too enjoyable for the listeners because no, that's you can a make visual it, thing. You can make it audible. Come on. You could do it. Yeah, like clogging, you know. <laughs> okay. I, okay, I, mean, so. I, I, I could do this. Oh. If, the, yeah. if that sounded good. <laughs> no. I had a friend that used to drink like eight glasses of Kool-Aid. And then he would just bounce up and down and dance, and you could hear it like a water bed. So you should try that. <laughs> please, please tell me he went. Oh yeah! <laughs> like in his body, he sounded like a keg you were shaking, just his stomach yeah. was sloshing around. <laughs> yeah, he, he would just chug Kool Aid and he would just do the Kool Aid dance. <laughs> it was like he was doing a load That's of laundry or the something. The worst feeling. It's like his version of the truffle shuffle. He does. My favorite part it. of the Kool-Aid dance is when you throw up 10 gallons of Kool-Aid right after <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you yeah. It's even better when you do it with Oh, no. <laughs> All of her bum's white carpet. Oh, no. <laughs> naughty, no naughty Kool-Aid. Um, so what we did for this episode is that we all kind of went back to the recordings we've done so far and found some of our favorite moments, some interesting clips, some funny stuff that makes us laugh, and we hear it over again. And we've pulled them, and this is going to be kind of a fun end of the year clip show. We all we all have a lot of stuff here, kind of prepared between like two and five or eight or something clips each. We all have our stuff, and I think that's really cool. I mean, it's a bottle. Yes, Albie, it's a bottle episode where we have no yeah. budget. Yeah, we just mm-hmm. do flashbacks and don't have any new content here. Uh, we're phoning it in. Happy New Year's. Hey, Happy flashback New Year's. episodes are the that's best. How, that's episodes. how you know we've actually got a full season, though. We've done a bullshit flashback episode. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm like hyped we're, we're through this enough that we actually have enough to do a recap of and wasn't like, hey, yeah. remember that time we had three episodes and it was great. <laughs> Let me like, guys, was guys, guys, remember when we talked to Boom Kitty a week ago? <laughs> yeah, that was a good episode. Was a good it episode. was. Hey, so what, do you guys, what do you guys think Tom thinks about this podcast after a year of it? What do you think he would say? Like, good job, guys. Good I job. wish they'd finally fucking stop this bullshit. <laughs> when is this over? Last time somebody asked that, I made a joke. I said Tom doesn't fucking listen to this. And like a couple of days later, we're on our Slack for work, and I do so listen, Josh. <laughs> calling you out. He's like, well, sometimes. <laughs> he said sometimes. Sometimes depends on who it is. Yeah. Except you had him very screamy, and I think the Tom Fault version of screaming is him turning around and going. Hey, so, you know, I actually do listen to the show. 
you know, you're, you're actually not that far off. <laughs> I just want you to not hurt my feelings when you said that. <laughs> no, I, I no. kind of feel like you don't think I listen. <laughs> we never talk anymore, hon. So, <laughs> when so you I, say that I don't listen to the show, it makes me feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, then listen to the show! So, what do you, how do you guys think, like, NGP has progressed throughout this year? Because in the beginning, it was, like, a mesh of, like, everyone just talking over each other. But it was, like, 30 And now we episodes. never do that. Yeah, do we I, never yeah, do yeah, that no, now. No, we, have like, no. we have, like, five people no, now. Yeah, never, no. So, yeah, guys, hey, guys, 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 hey, guys, 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 hey, guys, guys, hey, yeah. Hey, hey, what boba tea did I drink today? <laughs> but, but, hey, I want to hey, say, Zane, I have a question, hey. <laughs> I want to say I want to say that in the beginning though you guys it had a really like homey homely feel to it because it was just like a lot of friends hanging out and it, you guys would go over the new grounds front page you'd be over in like thirty minutes and and like yeah. it really it was really it was really heartwarming though and then now nowadays we just interview people like and we're very like strict and we get like a whole hour in of an episode every time and we try to do it every week like I took yeah. work off one week just to fucking do an episode but but you, do you know why why. Because because Tom Fulp doesn't like the episodes where we just talk and bullshit. He only likes the one where we talk to the creators. Those- <laughs> and to be clear, <laughs> yeah, everybody oh, listening oh. to this episode right now, the only reason we make this show is for Tom. He's a, <laughs> he's a patron, though. Listeners. He's allowed you know to. He's a patron. <laughs> yeah. All right. Man, what do, how do we want to start this off? Because it's been a yeah, crazy yeah, yeah. year. I mean, well, COVID, we the- COVID sucked, but but at least it brought a lot of people onto the show and brought everyone together in some kind of fucked up way during quarantine. It did. It did. It did. Yeah, I think we wanted to talk about, um, you know, some of the, the bright points of the Newgrounds podcast and how maybe it kind of helped with the year. And I think I think we did our part. We did a, We made a place for a lot of people to come and have yes. a good time and hang out and i mean the block party was really the epitome of it but i mean we had a lot of a lot of fun shit on the way um mm-hmm. i guess yeah. i guess i'll start then since i'm already fucking blabbering and sucking up all the air um so when i was brought on this podcast <laughs> It was literally supposed to be as a part-time host, uh, just to <laughs> kind of fill in when the regular Oops. hosts weren't available. As you know, we do most of our shows on the weekends, and not all interviews would work on the weekends. And I wasn't going to actually be available for the weekends because COVID hadn't quite hit yet when I was approached. Mm-hmm. Uh, so I was going to do interviews with people during the week. And it's like, you know, you could interview uh, Mike because we have him lined up. And I was like, yeah, that'd be cool. So I'll help out. I'll do a couple shows here and there. No problem. Well, that that kind of went to shit but anyway my uh my very first episode was not a planned episode um i don't even remember exactly how it happened all i know is i was drinking goodell was drinking henry was drinking ninja muffin was there i don't know who else was there but we're like it's St. Patrick's Day, by the way. Just that's why we're drinking. Not because right. we're all raging alcohol. <laughs> we're all raging alcohol. I mean, yes. <laughs> that there, too. Was a, that but. there was a reason. There was a reason we were all drinking that particular day. And yeah. we're like, well, it's St. Patrick's Day. Do you want to just do a, a show? And we're all drunk. We had no plan. We just decided to do a show. And this is my very first show, mm-hmm. uh, St. Patrick's Day. Started strong. So we we started the show, and good Al, Henry, and myself. <clears throat> excuse me, I'm drinking now, by the way. Uh, we're already <laughs> we're already three sheets to the wind, and uh, so we we did like an hour and a half show almost, I think, before it was edited. Uh, so, needless to say, we were, we were we were really fucking plowed by the end. Wait, and, if you're uh, talking about St. Patrick's Day, that that live show lasted four fucking hours because I was there for that. It, it just didn't end. And then Goodell, Goodell, Goodell passed out like at some point. <laughs> we only recorded yeah. an hour and a half. How about that? <laughs> That's right. Well, at the end of the show, uh, we got talking about – because it was my first show, everybody was asking what my, my admin abilities were. And I mentioned I could delete people. Or they were asking me to ban Han- Henry and then Cam's like, delete my account. So I did. And, uh, Will, you have a clip of that, I believe. <laughs> I have a clip of that, I believe. Yeah, it's called Let's delete Cam's it. account. Here it goes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ban ban Henry on Newgrounds right now. Yeah, I probably Don't should. Do He's Don't do it. Or mine. Can you delete my account? I can. I think it'd be funny. <laughs> I think it's time. I've been here long enough. I think it'd be really <laughs> funny. Deleted my whole account. 
I, I, I can do that right now. Pull the trigger. Right, pull the trigger. Do it, do it, do pull it. the trigger. Pull. <laughs> he doesn't know what he's saying. Hang on, and I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Hang on, one second here. Here we go. I gotta log into the server. Pull the first. trigger. <laughs> it's on. No, don't do it. Is it is it is it Ninja under dash muffin? No, or Ninja it... Ninja muffin ninety nine. Oh, I almost I almost killed the wrong Ninja muffin. Whoo, that would have sucked. Pull the trigger. Pull the Kill trigger. Everyone was fish. Ninja in their name. Do it. Do it. End me. <laughs> While we're at it, kill everyone's Wait, ego. I spelled then. something wrong. I have no, the wrong uh, No, you, you killed Psycho Lazy Fishes. Muffin, didn't no, you? You didn't spell it wrong, you spelled it in drunk. One, two, three. <laughs> no, right. I, I tried. I tried. Oh, wait. That's a uh, language. I'm pretty sure your name's not Ninja Miffin 99. Hey, I Ninja found you! Alright, here we go. Pull the trigger. Pull ben, the trigger ben, right ben, now. Ben, Pull the trigger. Alright, it's going on. <laughs> Pull the trigger. <laughs> If you delete Ninja Muffin's like last couple letters in his name, that would be super bad. No people rename him to Ninja Muffin. No people with numbers at the end of their name are the best. They're not dumb at all. Whoops! Finger slips. Deleted Lazy Muffin. All right, I'm pretty sure you're. Like, I'm pretty sure I just deleted Ninja Muffin ninety nine. Anybody want to verify yes. that? Yeah, yeah. Uh, holy shit! Everyone go. Everyone. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm checking. I'm on newgrounds.com right now. I'm on there right now. We did it. Didn't Ninja Muffin 99 like have a another podcast. name or something? Oh uh, no, he still exists. <laughs> Wait. No, okay, I'm getting check in. I don't. Wasn't it something else though? That's the end of the. Oh, fuck, it's gone. <laughs> The end of the podcast. That's the end of the podcast. Wait, 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 wait. So what happens now? Like, are you? Do you recover that? It's or? gone. It's gone. No, he's done. Okay. He's gone. He's, he's dead forever. It's over. I'm fading away. I'm fading away. This is the last episode of the Newgrounds podcast. This is. The... He's muted. He's gone. His Newgrounds account is deleted. That is all. That's it. Yeah, he's not even in the podcast episodes. What the hell? No, he's done. He's been he's gone. Podcast. I'm not even sure. He did actually delete it. We don't even wait, know. Wait, wait a minute. So, so how do you undo that? How do you how do you get? You, you don't. don't. You don't. You don't and, and for asking that question, I'm what do you what do you mean undo? <laughs> he's gone. It's <laughs> over. Are Are you familiar with how deleting works? It's just, it's open. The hard drive was smashed. When you delete something, it's gone. That's how deleting works. He's gone. That's it. The end of Ninja Muffin. Let's, let's have a short funeral for his game. Uh, whites only. Amazing grace. How and blacks sweet only. The Monster machine. Let's say prom. I mean, probably a prom goblin. I'm too drunk. Fuck me. I can't remember any other of his games. Oh, Ritz. Who, who <laughs> once was lost <laughs> and now was found. Amazing grace. All right. All right, that yeah. was it. Oh yeah, fuck <laughs> yeah, that was great. Oh my god. <laughs> actually, actually, can we go back in the past more? Because yes. there's more to that. Well, hold on, hold on, hold on. Quick note about Henry Eyes, though. I, I miss him. If we're yeah. talking about Wait. past episodes, yeah. I we... want to bring up Henry Eyes because he was the first person on NGP that I started talking to. And it was during that St. Patrick's Day. He was wasted. That's fine. And he's he's also the only, only person that was ever like, hey, I want to teach you how to draw and like i want to get you to draw more because i like i like what you're doing on new grounds and then oh. he set up a draw pile and we drew together and then during the black party i sent him a message because i didn't know how to set one up for the artist and then he he even helped me out a little bit with that so just shout out to henry eyes and i i really hope he's doing well because he's the yes he's the first like pe person in this community who gave me like a warm welcome i got to got to really get to know yeah that's awesome. Should we have, Henry, should we have a great. moment of silence for Henry, but then edit it out later? Yes, a let's do it. Dead air. So yes. we, we, don't, we don't want dead air. So moment of silence for Henry. Moment of silence. Mm -hmm. Amazing oh. grace. <laughs> <laughs>
yeah. You mentioned something about going earlier in time to that very same day. And that's good yeah. because people in the chat are also wanting to hear more singing from Josh. Yep. Perfect. Was uh, it me? <laughs> roll it. Yeah, I don't I don't have anything else to say. That was not the only singing done in that episode. Play yeah. the beginning of it. Okay, I will. It's Paddy's Day on NGP, so won't you raise a drink with me? We celebrate a Catholic saint by getting shit-faced, ain't that quaint? I hope you all a lucky charms and have green sleeves upon your arms. It's Paddy's Day, oh, don't you see? We're celebrating on NGP. I'm sorry if you're stuck at home, unable to go drink and roam, but you can still partake and cheer. Well, NGP drinks lots of beer. Oh, NGP drinks lots of beer. <laughs> Very good. I think I'll crack right. open a can right at that the end. That is beautiful. <laughs> Very nice. We should have harmonized. That was a fun. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think I was there for that, actually, but I was kind of like i'm living through it vicariously now it was a fun day i know i feel drunk listening to it it was surreal listening to that again because i literally don't remember like 80 percent of that <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Jesus. well then you have well. a st patty's day uh, clip too but is that it was without also the candy it's, the, it's, li- it's literally the same one yeah because with josh deleted ninja Got muffin <laughs> my mind my mind was fucking blown up <laughs> my favorite part of that was johnny in the background going um, guys, is that? But for real though, is that okay? Is that for real? <laughs> <laughs> so Should we like, be recording this? <laughs> the like sober person, like it's like we yeah. just committed a crime. Yeah, <laughs> your 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 life on Newgrounds is hanging by a thread, depending on if Josh is in a good mood or not. <laughs> so th- there is a little backstory to what I actually did, um, and it also involves alcohol, believe it or not. <laughs> surprise! Surprise! So, Back when the art portal first launched, we didn't have uh, quite as much moderation tools available. And I don't remember exactly what it was. Somebody was like, I don't know. We, we were all, we were actually all in Philly at the Newgrounds building. And we'd all been out at the bar drinking and we all came back to the office and we're all fucking plowed. And it turns out there's all these messages that somebody's like flooding the art portal with all this terrible art. And we have no way to like quickly delete it all. And being the quick thinking guy I am, I logged into the uh, actual command line, shit-faced. Um, Jesus. <laughs> got into the, the database, the raw database, shit-faced, and had this genius where if if you change somebody's user ID, it won't line up with anything else in the database. So I literally just made the guy's user ID the negative number of what it really is. So if we wanted to fix it, I could fix it. Oh, I, I thought of this. I thought of this when I was drunk. Dang. And... So I, after that, I've been able to like fake delete anybody I want, and <laughs> it doesn't really do any damage. You just turned wow. your username, your number, into the negative number of it. Yeah, yeah. So like if your user, if your user number is like four eight two, I just put a minus four eight two, and everything on the site is no longer linked to your account anymore. And negative numbers don't work on user pages or nothing. So that's smart. That's actually really smart. <laughs> I know. See, and it, drinking has drunk, like, benefits, guys. It has yeah. benefits. It Alcohol benefit. makes you smart. Kids drink. It makes you Kids smart. You can. Drink. Drink. The more you drink, <laughs> the better chance you get in Harvard. Keep drinking, guys. Mm. <laughs> yeah. If you get drunk, you can program new grounds yourself. So just make your own new grounds. <laughs> God, how is this website still? Standing? You you could be Tom Fulp. Just drink a liter a day. <laughs> just drink a liter. A day. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Cam- kombucha, that's what he drinks. Who, who wants to go next? <laughs> Who's next? Who's got good memories? We need memories. Yeah. Corey, I want to play one of yours. Uh, Corey, oh, okay, Corey, okay. the new guy. He's the newest. Corey. He's yeah. the newest guy. Corey, can, talk can about... Can you guys what... remember two weeks ago? <laughs> right, right. Yeah, guys, let's, let's think back two weeks ago because that says many brain cells I have. Well, so. actually, actually, Corey, <laughs> recap recap why you wanted to join uh, NGP. Like, give, you know what I mean? Like, go over that because I think each one of us oh, yeah, yeah. talk about, like, how we started on NGP. Yeah. Yeah. I don't mind doing that. Yeah, so... My first time on NGP, I came on to talk about the voice acting collaboration. Um, I was joined by Fro and one of our other voice actresses, Viva. It was cool getting to talk about uh, what got me into voice acting and got me onto new grounds and wanting to, you know, promote myself a little bit more uh, and promote the, you know, the voice acting collab. Like I think I just launched it maybe a month prior to joining the. 
uh, coming on for the show. And uh, we were getting some traction. And I think after that, we started getting more people, you know, applying and wanting to become like wanting to join and, and voice act in it. So it was really cool. It was a really good experience. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, after that experience, I stayed in touch with, you know, with, with Zinn and, and Josh and got to know you guys a, a, a little bit more. And it was really cool. Um, and then I got invited to join the Halloween session and, and that was a real hoot. Yes. <laughs> that, that, we have a, a, we have a memory of, uh, that's one of my clips that I've provided. Uh, one, <laughs> one particular <laughs> character in general was, you know, the, the show stealer. <laughs> um, and then of course, um, you know, I reached out to Goodell one day. Um, it, it was brought to my attention that uh, Goodell and, and Josh wanted to do more variety type shows. Um, and this is like literally right after I launched uh, the New Grounds voice acting collaboration. And I think a week prior, uh, Johnny and I, we joined the, the show to talk about that too and mm-hmm. have Johnny talk about, um, you know, the origins of Jack Sirius and, and all that good stuff. And I, I, I just proposed the idea. I'm like, hey, you know, I, I heard you guys are looking to do more variety episodes. I mean, I would love to potentially help you guys out if you're cool with that and, you know, maybe come on as a host. And Goodell said, you know, I don't want to speak for everybody else. And, you know, I don't want to say yes. But yes, <laughs> so <laughs> right, we, and, and then after that, the the idea was proposed to everybody else, and we got together and said yes, and came on, had my first show with with Josh, and it was an absolute blast. We had you know the first uh, we had a variety hour show. Uh, Josh and I talked about things going on in Newgrounds, and then we had uh, improv game show with Bold King Cole, Nick Senny, and Spadzer, and I joined in on the fun. And that kind of ties into my first clip. Uh, mm-hmm. We were playing, <laughs> we were playing the the dating game. I was the bachelorette, and I love this clip in particular because it was banter with who I do consider a really good friend now, uh, Nick. <laughs> nice. He was uh, he was doing, uh, I guess, an impression <laughs> of Falcor from the Neverending Story, and oh just God. the dialogue was. Hilarious. So we'll, we'll just, <laughs> he, we'll just he lead didn't right know into who that. Who was? So I got to do that. He had no, yeah, idea, who he, he had no was. idea who he was. He, he literally, he literally googled it. He, he googled the picture, and I think he saw a Wikipedia page, and he just he rolled with it. It was fucking great. Jesus. Like okay. the voice, the voice works so well. <laughs> All right, roll the tape. <laughs> All right, this next one, we are going to play the dating game. Um, this is going to take a second to set up. I. I am actually going to send you guys direct messages of what your characters are. So nobody but you knows your characters. Bear with me while I send everybody their shit. And Corey, Corey, you are the bachelorette. So the other guys, they are the bachelors. If you're familiar with the dating game, the bachelors, basically, they sit inside and the bachelorette gets to ask them a question. You answer the question as your character. And when the game is over, we have to see if Corey can figure out who you are. So don't straight up give your characters away, but just have fun with it. <laughs> okay, contestant number two, I like to do couples massages, but what if you were to give me a personal massage? Considering my body is, oh, I'm not entirely too sure, acres upon acres long, I think I just lay right on top of you and wiggle around. <laughs> It sounds extravagant. <laughs> I can bring in a couple friends to help out as well. And now you're talking my language. How about this language? <laughs> That's the clip. <laughs> oh my, oh my I listened gosh. to it earlier today, and I'm just listening to it now. I'm still dying. My, I have oh, tears man. in my eyes. It's just so damn funny. <laughs> Holy shit! Half, half of that oh game had to be laughing. Right? Had yeah. to be like, how much laughing did you have to cut out of that, Corey? <laughs> oh, dude! Like, especially during that that moment, I think I had to cut out almost ten to fifteen seconds of it. Just laughing. <laughs> that like during that and um. 
shoot, what was the other one? I think just like the debacle of of uh, cops. <laughs> I, had to, I had to chop that down because there was so much dead space. I'm like, oh man, how am I going to make this work and at least sound good? <laughs> but Corey, no, yeah, like the yeah. Let me just say, man. Ever since, ever since, like you did the work for Groundsbreaking, and like you started, like I started seeing you on voice acting everywhere. Before, before Corey got involved in anything, he was like reading stories on New Grounds. Like you had them audio, like stories or whatever. And like I yeah. found out, like every single month, Corey has like this new voice acting thing that blows me away he can do like so many different voices and right now he's part of the like this voice acting competition on twitter or whatever and and cory just your involvement in newgrounds and your support that just came like so strong and heavily like out the gate like you've always <laughs> been one of the most positive people like i've ever met and you're so talented like thank you so much for like reaching out and like wanting to be on ngp too because yeah uh, i I don't know, man. I got a lot of love for everything you do. You're you're fucking you're awesome, man. I don't know how you make time for everything, but you do. <laughs> Shit, dude. Fuck, man. That, that means a lot, man. Thank you. I, yeah, I, and, I really do appreciate that, man. Similar note. It's weird. Like, Zen, we've only known Corey for, fuck, what, five, six months, if that? Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah and, since April. <laughs> but he's like, a, it feels like he's a dude that's been in our, our circle of friends for, well, Zen, I've only met, like, when COVID started, too. It's like all of us are like in this giant circle of friends and it feels like we've known each other forever, but God, yeah. <laughs> it's been like months, literally months. Like, yeah. like one of the, one of the best things, like that's one of the reasons why I love new ground so much is the fact that the community is so strong and everybody loves each other and they want to build each other up and get them to their goals and aspirations. Like I have been on new grounds you know, since like 2002, you know, just being a regular, you know, just a regular user going on playing flash games, watching the animations. And I think I created my account in 08 just to have an account and, you know, gain points and, and raid and all that good stuff. And it wasn't until 2014 when I got the balls to actually record my voice. In 2014, I was literally recording on like a Guitar Hero USB mic just plugged into my damn laptop. It was horrible audio. It sounded like crap. And and just like the first couple uploads, people were saying, hey, you you got something here. And then, you know, I see Zen post in the voice acting uh, forum saying, hey, I'm doing this project. I'm looking for voice actors. I reached out and he goes, what can you do, man? I'm like, oh, I can do a bunch of voices. I can do accents. He goes, oh, what, what, what accents can you do? I'm like, I can do, you know, German, French, Russian, you know, Irish, Scottish, British, all, all the typical ones. He goes, oh, okay, cool. Send me some content. So I sent him um, a couple, I think British, French, and I think he was really impressed by my French. He goes, all right, yeah, we'll, we'll have you on. What's that? That's a good Zen impression, by the way. <laughs> oh, you know, I can do my Zen impression for you if you want. <laughs> <laughs> spot, spot that, on. That is spot on, Corey. It's spot like, on, yeah. man. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> uh, Wait, but, uh, the, am I talking? Wait, is it two of me? What's going on? I have to shoot one. Well, what Which are you one talking about, man? I'm, I'm the real Zin. I'm the real Zin. Ha <laughs> 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 oh, shit, man. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, but like, si since, since um, you know, joining Groundsbreaking, it, it basically opened up the doors for more opportunities, getting to know more people, and just... Being a part of, of a community that is just grand and amazing, and I owe I owe a lot of my you know growth in my career to to new ground. So you know coming on and helping out with with NGP has has been amazing so far, and it's <laughs> honestly kind of like a way of giving back to the community in my own way. So that's awesome. I man. I, I love being a part of you know the crew, and I love you guys so much. Aww. That's so nice. Okay, Thanks, I know we're gonna get to Halloween, but I want to because you made me so <laughs> soft in the heart place. I want to play the first time I ever heard you on a microphone. Okay. Okay. And it was during the block party when you won the fucking switch. All right. Ah! <laughs> oh God, we all Here still hate comes. you for that. Yeah. <laughs> I included no, you have to give it back. I included it no, earlier on. No, no, no. <laughs> We talked uh, about this. You take it away. You ruined my daughter's life. So don't do that. <laughs> she I loved it a couple minutes uh, before that of just us doing the raffle because the block party raffle was so buck wild and insane. And uh, I don't. I think it was a bit more 
would put up a bit more than we could chew for that, perhaps. But it was also yeah. really fun to get things out. Um, so I'm going to play this. This is Raffle going into somebody winning something very important. Here it goes. Next up, this is the uh, this is the <laughs> stop stop posting that image of the switch. <laughs> I'm sick of it. <laughs> They're spamming We're getting our chat there. right now. We're getting there. Hold your horses. Hold up. Okay. Oof, oof, All oof. right. The winner of the. 001 Alien Hominid Plush donated to us by Lewis. Thank you very much, <laughs> Lewis. Lewis wins it. It's Lewis! You did it! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Yay. Yay. <laughs> Shipping costs or anything. Congratulations. No, okay. Yes. The oh, winner of the... A- no, shut up. <laughs> 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 the winner of the Alien Hominid Plush donated by Lewis is Snail Pirate. Congratulations yeah. and thank you. Nice! Nice. I like Snail Pirate. You, you yeah, deserve Snail Pirate's it. cool. All right, it's time. Now Burn. we're gonna watch the room. All right. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> good night, everybody. Thank you for coming. You sure. guys had a good time. Now's, now's now's your time. Spam spam those images of the of the Wii U apparently for some reason and. Uh, <laughs> Oh God! It's flooded. Okay. All right. Keep, keep it coming. Keep it coming. All right. This is this. This is the drum roll. It's just this image rolling in again. And again. Anybody who's not here live, uh, <laughs> basically, what's happening is we're seeing a massive flooding of the chat. Holy shit! It's ridiculous. <laughs> All right. It's time. The winner of the Nintendo Switch. Uh, you know what? We'll go ahead and just hit me with like a million air horns, really quick. <laughs> The winner of the Nintendo Switch is Voices by Corey. Yeah, I know that guy. Yeah. He ain't even here, is he? What a he's not even here. Fuck. That's bullshit. No, no, no. He's here. He's here. He's here. Is he he is here. I can't find him. There's nobody switches. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even. I don't even know if he said anything. <laughs> may should should we get him on the? Should Corey, we get him in the voice here? And yeah, get him in voice. Let's get it. Voices by Corey. You got voices a voice. by Corey. We gotta hear that voice by Corey. Yeah, get voice. here. Let's hear your voice, voice by, by Corey. Corey. Hang Let's out. hear it. Hello. Yo, what's up, guys? Yeah, Yay! you are the winner of a brand new <laughs> Yo, Nintendo you, Switch. Awesome. How many tickets did you buy? <laughs> Uh, no, don't don't tell anybody. People I'm who, kidding. People don't who, tell anyone. People who bought more are going to be oh, like, "What? Well, like, what? One thousand? Yes, perfect. <laughs> perfect. That's, That's a how correct much answer. The, the Switch costs. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what game are you going to get if you want to get one? Play. No games. No games. No games. Just gonna have I don't know. There's a lot of good. There's a lot of good games out there. I'll probably play some sort of Mario game on there. <laughs> oh, yeah. some Super Mario Odyssey. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, Paper Mario, Mario. Oh, Smash, Bros. Smash Bros. Oh, yeah, Smash yeah, Wild, uh, Super Smash Bros. Or, Ultimate, Animal Crossing, Mario Kart. Tom says Gato Roboto. Gato Roboto. <laughs> Gato Roboto. Of course, uh, yeah, Castle, Castle Crashers. Crashers. Castle <laughs> Crashers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cool. Okay. Well, congratulations. congratulations. Yeah. Thank right. you again, guys. That's awesome. <laughs> right. Corey, I love you, Corey. Let me borrow your Switch. Damn it! Everyone oh, hates man. me. Hold on, does that clip end with me saying everyone hates me? <laughs> God damn it. God. Perfect. You know what's so funny yeah. is I, I, I'm up at my in-law's cabin up in Big Bear at the time, and I think we were playing Cards Against Humanity, and I get a direct message from Will saying, hey, man, uh, can you go on voice chat right now? I'm like, yeah, why? And, you go, and you're like, shut up. the fuck up. Get on voice chat right <laughs> yeah. now. I'm like, OK, fuck I don't care what you're doing, where your family is. Get on voice so chat I, in Discord. I, I, I literally grab my phone and say, hey, guys, I got to take a shit. <laughs> and I go into the bathroom, <laughs> hop on VC, and I find out I want to switch. So I was like, this is the greatest shit of my life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, we're never doing a raffle oh, again. Man. Though. No, I heard that was a lot of work. Fuck that. No, that was a nightmare. We raised <laughs> like what? We had like four hundred dollars that went into that raffle or whatever. I think right? if we raised six hundred, we got back like six hundred and ten. It was ridiculous how like clearly not for profit it was. <laughs> like we literally <laughs> at the last second made it back. <laughs> right. But yeah. it, it worked out. Shout out to Newgrounds for donating, or we're not donating for buying raffle tickets. We made it clear that none of this was going to us. It was literally just to send out gifts. Tons of people got stickers. Tons of people got flags, and yeah. it was cool seeing everyone get something cool. Yeah. Everyone, oh, someone, someone got a Wave Patrol shirt too. That shit was awesome. Yeah. And I got drunk. 
You got drunk. <laughs> <laughs> it was fucking. That's a consolation cool. prize right there. I can't yeah. believe how drunk I was. Uh, yeah. Besides the drunkenness, can. though, if you guys like that, uh, just imagine that all four of us at the time were like eight hours into a very intense event planning thing, and we're just oh, about God. ready to pass. <laughs> that energy was 100% from something. Yeah. Yes. Do, yeah. Uh, do we, what, do we want it? to talk about the original planning for that? How it was, we had, we were going to try and plan it in like a fucking week. We're, are we going to talk yeah. about that? Oh yeah. yeah. Let's, let's just go through the whole block party. Me. I think that was, you guys that was were like, a big in thing eight days, us. we're going to do this thing called a black party. We think, can you get artists? <laughs> I was like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no 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 in fairness when we said that we were imagining you would get maybe three artists oh yeah no <laughs> which is fair i'm glad you got more but in the end you got how many artists did you work i think with 24 24 <laughs> yeah yeah i mean also in fairness the event when it, you know when the idea was conceived i don't think any of us thought it was going to be that big yeah, like, no, I think honestly. it was supposed to be a pretty small, like just a little a thing hangout. that we were gonna do for fun. Yeah, yeah, like a little yeah. hangout, and it turned into a fucking several hundred people. Like right. it was basically what Pico event. Day would be normally. We we actually had this year's Pico Day, basically. Yeah, I mean right we did we did a Pico Day too, but this was the real deal. It yeah. was <laughs> really cool. It, it was like I I jumped on and played Jackbox for maybe like forty five minutes, like earlier in the day. And just seeing all the rooms full of people chatting, uh, like it, even with uh, Zen and, and and the art channels, there's people in there. Like there's people all over the place, and it was cool seeing all these people coming together to just play games and and yeah. get to know one another. Like I had a few people who I had been you know messaging back and forth with on Newgrounds, were like, "Hey, are are you gonna do the block party? Like, yeah, I'm I'm gonna play some games. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna do it." Do it, man! Like jump on and <laughs> play a game or two, and and see if you yeah. meet someone new. And and, and it's cool. Like uh, I'm I'm pretty sure a lot of people met new users and are good mm-hmm. friends now because of the block party. You know, it, it opens up the door to allow people to just yeah. converge yeah. and and build upon the stuff that you do already on Newgrounds. It's really yeah. it was really cool. Well, that's that's what's cool about Newgrounds. Everyone brings something different to the table. So you could be a voice actor meeting an animator. Like it doesn't matter who you meet. You guys could just make cool shit together. It doesn't matter. It's right. Very true. Yeah. But and also, then uh, there's like towards that, there's the fact that when you're on Discord, you kind of pigeonhole into your one community and talk to your maybe dozen or so like closies, you know? So it's cool to get people into a bigger thing meeting new people on Discord because people can 100% like sit in their click in Discord and not meet anybody else, right? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> cough, absolutely. Cough, party games and chill, cough, cough. <laughs> <laughs> Josh had yeah. it on me. <laughs> <laughs> But I also talk about like what a way to like just kind of blow off some steam after such a long and weird summer too. Like I think a lot of people yeah. needed something like that, and it was yeah. very cool to just have any part in providing that. Like it was very fulfilling. Yes. We're not doing yeah. it again though, right? No, we are. We <laughs> have to, bro. You know how it many artists a... ask me to do it again? Like it's gonna have to be like an all day thing too, like because they want to draw for two hours next time. And a lot of the artists afterwards, wow. they told me it was cool meeting everyone. Like Kyuri 08 has all these friends in art now, like from Newgrounds. Like it, it brought everyone together that you never see draw together. And I've gotten nothing but positive feedback from it. So we kind of have to have to yeah. do it again. But it wouldn't have been nothing without the community that showed up because our server went from like I think a hundred. 170 to like 600 or 800 people and then yeah. at some point during the art streams the, the entire voice chat was filled up no one else could join everyone was just listening to me like <laughs> talk to artists like yeah it's shout, shout out to everyone that showed up and and, and hung out like yeah. i appreciate you guys it's, on the note um, of the feedback too it was really cool to see new grounds on the couple days after the block party too because like every news post was about the block party. Yeah, like, I couldn't believe it. That was so I could cool. not believe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, how you know? I'm not trying to blow my own horn here, but like it was really cool to see <laughs> just how much of an impact it had. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. and and people, it was either like people posting about how cool the block party was and how glad they were that they were there, or people being like, "Shoot, you know, seeing everything." Like all I'm seeing on Newgrounds today is block party, and so. Uh, you know, I'm sad I wasn't there, but I'm excited for it next time. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, for hell sure. yeah! It was, it was really great. Cool. It was it was just a random idea that popped up, but it would have been nothing without the community. And then if if we could play my next clip, well, yes. we could play. Okay, 
It's the uh, it's number episode twenty nine. The NGP Open Forum in the Newgrounds the Revolution. Conversation. You call it yes. the Revolution. Yeah. All right. Cool. 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 Here it comes. <laughs> that, is, that is my one concern. Who else would like to be on Wonder Swifty? Uh, 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 uh. I have an opinion that's controversial. Perfect. 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 Come on, Crypto Cat. Hello. Hello. Hello, Crypto Cat. Also Hi, known as C- Speak. You what? have been muting them for too long. Let the public speak! All right. Okay. Uh, uh, it appears we're suffering uh, technical difficulties. Uh, <laughs> Crypto Cat, also known as C Cunt 2, suddenly got muted. I don't know what happened. I don't know if Craig did it. I don't know if that was someone else. Um, I will let someone else on. Who else would like to come on to the show? Holden would like to have the microphone. As you know, Holden is wearing two tuxedos right now hello holden hello how are you hello. doing today hello i'm doing Do you, all right how are you pretty good do you have any criticisms of the new grounds podcast i do i do um so my primary criticism is are, are you are you are you sitting in your chair are you ready for this yes i am currently right. sitting in my chair fully clothed feeble mind prepared oh my feeble mind <laughs> all right, all right buddy. <laughs> all right. so my criticism is you guys are doo-doo heads, and I want a job. And you want, wait, hold on, you can't have both, buddy. <laughs> you, can't, <laughs> you, can't, you can't cause doo-doo heads and then expect to work with us in a work environment. Because as you know, this is a hierarchy. This is a dictatorship. You understand? You understand me? Yeah, you understand yeah. me? <laughs> of course. So how much money? <laughs> how much, how much? <laughs> the application must be sent in with at least two crisp dollar bills of your choosing. I can do three. You do three? Okay. All right, buddy. Now you're getting there. Now you're getting there. What would your role be in the Newgrounds podcast? Janitor. <laughs> that was the yeah. question. Yeah. Yeah. Newgrounds podcast. Uh, I love Holden. We would be nothing Janitor. if it weren't for the community and the people who show up. And I, I, a lot of feedback I got for the Newgrounds podcast was that we should invite a lot of more people, a lot more users that are on the website because people want to know about them, like the different animators, the different musicians. Yeah. And just bring them on and talk to them. Like everyone in the audience right now, you guys are what makes the Newgrounds podcast so special. And I feel like if we can get around to getting to know everyone, it'll make us like more of a community, which is all I ever wanted to see from the Newgrounds podcast. Now, that's a good segue. And I hate to jump in line because I know a couple of you haven't done clips yet, but uh, it's such a good segue that. Not everybody's a great member of the community necessarily. I mean, they are in their own way, but some people get a little <laughs> little shady. And oh um, also, if you play this clip, I've heard it, and I can go get another beer. So uh, it's also very selfish of me. Great, uh, great. But, uh, uh, Will, you know the clip I'm talking about. Uh, the Henry goes down the rabbit hole. With yeah, the, yeah, yeah. Thank you. I needed a yeah. little bit more context. <laughs> yeah, this yeah. is going to be good. Uh, go get your beer. We'll have fun with that. Yeah. Show. All right, moving on. Anyway, next question. <laughs> Holy Blizzard says, what do you think of people that find shit disgusting, especially shit belonging to attractive people of the opposite (laughs) sex? How do you convince them that it smells amazing and tastes amazing and looks amazing? Listen to me. In case you guys don't know, (laughs) Gory Blizzard is a fucking legend. Gory Blizzard, are you listening right now? If you could give me a little little sign of life in the uh, on-air live chat, I'd really appreciate that. Anyway, what's the answer, guys? <laughs> uh, Henry, I think you are uniquely qualified to answer a question regarding how to convince other people of the high, <laughs> high quality <laughs> shit, literal fecal matter from an attractive person of the opposite sex. Listen to it's, me. You know, I don't support Gory Blizzard, but I support Gory Blizzard, whatever <laughs> he needs does that's in the law between consenting adults. He can do that <laughs> himself. <laughs> a terrible answer. Josh, how do you convince somebody of the opposite or no, how do you convince anybody that shit from an attractive person of the opposite sex is well, amazing and delicious. delicious. Amazing and looks amazing. Let, let me break down his question first. Let's let's look at the first line. What do you think of people that find shit disgusting? Especially blah blah blah. Well, I'm one of those people and I think those people are fucking great. <laughs> the average person. <laughs> is this just us shitting on Corey Blizzard? 
<laughs> this reminds me of uh, the last time we did something like this, where we were just kind of browsing the forums for stuff to talk about. <laughs> the one person that we read their message was like, why do you humans find death so scary? <laughs> I like this is a very similar question. What is it with you humans and being repulsed by feces? <laughs> that, yo. <laughs> Fucking humans. Go to go to the feces.com forums or whatever it's called. Go find people like yourself. <laughs> people who had the same experience. Henry, I'm not gonna do this, so I need you to do it. Will you please open a new tab and type oh, in no. feces.com and go Listen to it? Okay, okay, let's see. <laughs> Feces. I don't know how to spell feces. <laughs> yes. F E. F E C E S. Or as you would say it, feces.com. 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 Okay, well, we're going somewhere. We're going somewhere. Uh, yeah, okay, feces.com is available for sale. Listen to me. After okay, this okay. show, Corey, go okay, fund me. Gory Blizzard says you should try freshscat.com. Oh, there you go. We got a good recommendation. recommendation. Listen to me. I'll, I'll take one for this. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take one for the team. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Oh, wow. This is exactly what I should be, by the way. <laughs> I'm <gonna> close that. <laughs> so, okay, now, that, now that you've seen that, how do you convince somebody that it's tastes amazing and smells amazing and looks amazing? Uh, drugs? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, drug, there's some drugs drug, out there. Drug, you got to drug them. Is that what you're saying? Exactly. That's the only. One. <laughs> it's one of the ways. It's one of the Gory ways. Blizzard. We appreciate you, Gory Blizzard. One day Good we'll question. interview you. Good question, Gory Blizzard. Thank you so much. Moving on. <laughs> and we never interviewed him. <laughs> <laughs> Henry talked to him for like an hour after that show, and it just got deeper and deeper. And Henry's like, "Is he for? Is he real? Is he no? For, is he real? There's no way he is he real? Like he couldn't believe it." But yes, that's that's the dude. Yeah, he's on the he's, he's on the forums about, a lot. Like, I see him in the forums all the time. Gordon wow. Blizzard. He was, he was talking yeah. about like several times that he's met AOC, and like, it was uh, oh, wow. it was an interesting. It was an interesting chat, for sure. Fresh scat, <laughs> and also when I met AOC. That's like a weird combining of things that I wouldn't have thought of before. You know, yep. you, you like poop, you like politics. Why not merge the two, you know, bring your hobbies together? Poop politics. Exactly. <laughs> wow. That was a good clip. I uh, I had a really good time <laughs> with that segment. Um, that was really fun. That was a fun, fun experience. I can tell. Letting people... Like live post in a forum thread as we respond to it. That was cool. Yeah. <laughs> I have another awesome. just random segment of yours, Goodell. That's just kind of like chilling with the gang and having fun. If you want me to play that, is it uh, finger pits? Yeah, it's finger pits. So I guess yeah. Before you play it, um, I was hoping that maybe COVID would come up again so I could get a good segment <laughs> for, or a segment for this. Okay, we, we don't want COVID coming up again. Sucks ass. We'll edit it. So, what yeah. do you think Man, about that, that Goodell? That um, Gory Blizzard sure is a uh, weird guy, but that he's he's sick like coronavirus. Boy, COVID sure is making people weird. Speaking of COVID, what? Uh, early on, <laughs> <laughs> early on in the uh, the COVID debacle, I. Uh, I, so, like, I always wash my hands pretty religiously, but oh at that time, I was, like, intensely, like, just destroying my hands. And uh, so, this was, like, the first time that we really addressed the pandemic on the show. Mm-hmm. And uh, to go along with Will's segue that uh, may or may not have been edited out, um, it, yeah, I think this is another good just example of the old crew, you know, hanging out with... Uh, Stagger Knight, I think, really makes this one. Stagger Knight Aww. was uh, yes. lovely to have around. Um, pour one out for my boy Stagger Knight Stagger and Knight. play the clip. All right. Stagger. So how are you guys uh, dealing with the uh, all the downtime? I can't go to school anymore. We're now all doing online learning. I got to talk about my knuckles. 
I am washing that's... my hands so much. <laughs> all of my knuckles are bleeding and have scabs in between, like my little finger pits. My finger pits bleed. Like, I have been washing my hands relentlessly. See, the irony there is now you've got all these open wounds that can get infected with viruses. That's what I'm so saying. you gotta wash it even more. I know. I keep never washing want to hear no skin. the word finger pits ever again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> I mean, what would you call them? (laughs) I don't know, but I have finger pits. Now I'm scarred. (laughs) He's got webs. (laughs) I got got freaking frog hands. (laughs) Nice. Finger pits. Love them. Good stuff. I like how that one line named the whole episode, too. (laughs) That's that's like like 45 seconds, right? Yeah. (laughs) And that whole uh, almost hour-long episode is named after that. (laughs) (laughs) That is the legacy. It's what has lasted past everything else. It's what we're all thinking about right now. We're all sort of kind of looking at our own hands, just kind of thinking about it. Yeah, okay, now I'm going to bring it up again. What, if not finger pits, what else do you call those? You're webbing. Web. It, yeah. Real webs. The webs Ew, of that's your fingers. Gr- that's way grosser than finger pits. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking frog people. Josh, stop, that's man. Gross. <laughs> I, know you, I know you've been in Louisiana for a while, but you, you haven't turned into a full frog person yet, have you? <laughs> I was on the bayou. I was. I tried gumbo. I got. I got to eat gumbo, and I know how to shuck oysters now. Yeah. I was on the bayou. You're gonna gumbo. be the next Forrest Gump, bro. Owning right. your own shrimp boat. Hey, hey, but do you guys miss that? You guys miss just like sitting around fucking like shooting the breeze. Yes. Before you know, before the episodes. No, I'm not from Louisiana. I I moved from Michigan for the winter. Just came down to Louisiana. Got a place. Got a job. And I hang, I'm hanging out now in New Orleans. Yeah. Oh, but do you guys New miss Orleans. it? You guys miss just sitting around just like bullshit and shooting the breeze, talking about what's going on in Newgrounds and what's happening in your own lives? Like, You're I, talking about just should... the non-interview episodes to just turn the mic on and hang? Well, maybe maybe just in the beginning of every like episode, we could just hang out and make, you know what I mean? And then do yeah. an interview or something. I like that. You know, we, you turn the mic on and we have our bit and then we bring on, if there's somebody on, we bring them on afterwards. Kind of like... Oh man, that was great. All right, we got a guest today, and et cetera, et cetera. We should definitely talk more with each other, find out what's going on, or like just banter, just talk about what's going on in Newgrounds. Because I see cool shit on Newgrounds like every fucking day, and I just wanna wanna talk about it with my friends. Yes. Everyone else is like, "What's Newgrounds?" Like my mom, I showed her, I showed her. She like texted me from Michigan. She was like, uh, "Can I listen to your podcast?" I was like, "Sure." I told her go to Newgrounds, search up Zen Zenix, and she listened to it. She's like, "Oh, you sound great!" Like. Like, uh, she went to people... Newgrounds. She played Frank's Adventure, and she's like, "This is a great website." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then she found the the hentai. And then... <laughs> well, yeah, she got yeah. all the medals in the recent meet and fuck game. That's right, dude. <laughs> I would be proud. I don't know about you guys. I'd be fucking proud. I like just Wait, hanging out and yeah. just doing stuff, and also like we just kind of have fun. And a lot of the fun moments of the show come from just hanging out and being weird and also a lot of it is a little bit too short to like be like a quote-unquote segment it's just us saying something funny and laughing about it and ripping on it i i mean duh that's a good part of a show i do have this and josh gave me this psycho goldfish and i want to play it now this is just you uh we we had a lot of clips that were just like very short and so this is a super cut of a lot of just kind of the shorter things and things that you yeah uh there might be something you've already heard just very shortly but you know it's live. Today's episode hosted by Goodell, Will Comer, and Zinks. How do you say this? You're listening to the Newgrounds Podcast. I'm Goodell, and I'm joined in the studio today by Henry Eyes. My name is Henry I- Actually, it's Henry Evil, yes. Uh, the E stands for evil. So anyone who is here, just follow Logan Fresh. Give him some more follows. He honestly deserves it. Do it, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> just start it off with like a nipple and then just, just go from there. <laughs> and if it's just the nipple too, you know. Who kn- it could be a man's nipple, could be a woman's nipple, could be a non-binary nipple. Literally nobody knows, and that's like the fun part about it. You throw the nipple yeah. in and then never never mention it again. I'm curious, how much of the audio portal is 
adult theme because I know it's a lot of the art portal. A lot of it. Oh, I was is there a bunch of audio what? that's like porn audio? I was like, that's something oh, yeah, I haven't been dude. aware of. Have you not seen it or heard it? I Moan mean, heard it? No. What is it? What is it? Uh, I'll, I'll, we'll talk about that later, maybe. No, let's talk about <laughs> it now. I gotta talk about my knuckles. I am washing that's... my hands so much that <laughs> all of my knuckles are bleeding and have scabs in between, like, my little finger pits. My finger pits bleed. Like, I have been washing my hands relentlessly. See, the irony there is now you've got all these open wounds that can get infected with viruses. I know, with So you gotta wash it even more. I know. I keep never washing want to hear no skin. the word finger pits ever again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> I think you'll get yeah, a lot more <laughs> like, well, let me think about what I'm going to say comments. You yeah, know? you got to make it a good one. And oh, it's meant yeah. to be a review, not a comment. So it's mm. it's really asking you to critique. It's not asking you to just say, hey, yeah, good job. Show us your tits. Uh, you know? <laughs> and then most, most YouTube did, comments how just... The, how did the big demon and, and the schlubby guy... How did they, how did they make a puppy? <laughs> 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 that I see on YouTube. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I've got like, like amazing legs. My quads can just go... <laughs> and you can see all the definition. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Shaping the arms, you know, my ass, you can bounce a quarter off, but then my stomach, that's a whole other story. <laughs> and then uh, and then I suggested that the person who wins the push-up contest should control Newgrounds, and then we should have did a, like, Newgrounds push-up contest, because I was actually, I can do 66 push-ups, like, I'm not yeah, trying see, to brag. What, what happened, yeah, Zinn posted, posted a video on social media of himself doing push-ups, and everybody saw how many he could do, and we were all like, nope, I'm out. <laughs> oh, I can feel my booty dance. I guess the only thing I'm not interested in is, uh, is scat because because yeah, it's it's poopy. I don't I don't I don't, I don't like. <laughs> oh, that was a lot of good stuff. <laughs> wow, and that was wonderful. MK Mop was the opposite of Goy Blizzard because <laughs> <laughs> it's poopy. You know, I like poopy. It's poopy, you know. <laughs> Just makes sense. <laughs> oh, there's so many good things in that that pivot on the other things. Yeah. Yo, thanks that for was really fun. thanks for letting me on Newgrounds podcast, by the way, because I I never asked you guys. You guys asked me, and I appreciate that. Because after the block party, I was like, I do like hanging out with these guys. Oh, yeah. absolutely. How do we get half of the funny stuff on the show nowadays without you in it? And you're fun. And you're a good interviewer. I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, I said it. Even though, even though I do ramble, and then for the for the madness episode, I was fucking hung over. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> I <true. couldn't> fuck- <laughs> That'll never happen again. That was that that was the worst episode ever. I actually didn't think but- it was that bad because I had also done interviews of madness people, not knowing a single thing about madness, so I related to it. You know, just asking people like, so the guy with the X on his face. Who is that? <laughs> mega, <laughs> mega Jesus. <laughs> they're, mega they're, Jesus. They're like, wait, did he say something else? <laughs> did he say the N-word? That was bad. Yeah. And it was the auditor instead. Uh, remember, remember when we did extras? Shout out to Seven Seas, by the way. That interview was awesome. Seven Seas on Newgrounds. She's a cool She's person. great. She, yeah. Yeah, she, she draws good, too. Zen, now that I've... Um, talked good about you and told you how I feel I want to play this to bring you back down and humble you just a little bit <laughs> thank you thank you of course go alright we're actually we're actually gonna do the skit alright you ready what's the skit are you ready for this uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna launch into like a little introduction and then we're gonna go on from there about what the Newgrounds Audio Deathmatch oh, alright I'll show you uh, alright mm. ah. alright it's the new grounds audio deathmatch 2020. I'm here with Phono with Trilogist. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Look, this is like my fifth time, I think, doing this. See, the thing is, like, you're you're like revving up at 100, percent and I'm like, I'm like, just I can't match that energy. <laughs> he wasn't happy with you. Yo, yeah, no, he was. Let me talk about that. All right, me and Phono with Trilogist. <laughs> We talked for like an hour and a half, right? So I had a half hour of banter of just talking to him, you know, like I do normally. I like being just a normal person with people. Like I don't I don't want to sugarcoat anything. So I was just talking with him. And then I try to launch it in this segment, knowing damn well he didn't want to do an interview in the first place. He d- he doesn't think he doesn't he doesn't think like anything he has to say is like either interesting or like um important enough for people to listen to. So I just, I launch into this thing and I revved it up such high expectations that he was turned off 
from the interview and <clears throat> the momentum died instantly. I had to cut out like six <laughs> minutes of just awkwardness after that to where he was like, look, man, oh, listen. No. And then the conversation pretty much died. But I, I brought it back, but I felt bad because I knew he didn't want that. And I, I still tried launching into it knowing full well it was just going to crash land. <laughs> but afterwards, <laughs> afterwards, phone of a child just sent me a message on Discord, actually. And he was like, hey, thank you for editing that you made the conversation sound really good and i appreciate everything you did cheers bro oh so. that's great oh that's cool i didn't know there was so much like dead time in the middle that you cut out i thought he just yeah. kind of rolled with it and was like no no that's stupid ask me a real question no, no. I, had to, I had to delete a lot like from that uh-huh. at least did you end up talking to him for like an hour hour and a half we ended up just <laughs> bull crapping for five so minute interview. interesting yeah, yeah, yeah. When someone's <laughs> interesting, I told him that too. I'm like, uh, I gotta cut this down to five minutes. When someone's <laughs> interesting, I can't help it. I just, just two human beings just have to, having conversations about life. Yeah, <laughs> it was fun. It was really fun. You know, when you did that, I kind of like felt I did the opposite, where I was like very kind of like, all right, hey, this is gonna be five minutes. So sorry, we gotta just ask a certain couple of questions and get through with it. And like, I probably could have had a better, more long conversation with Machiavelli, and if I'd done that instead of just being like. Hey, so we're doing a, a thing, and can I ask you a couple questions? Uh, how did you do? You like music? Yes, great. Okay, check. Okay, that's been five minutes. Thank you so much. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, phone of astrologist right Hollywood. off the rip was like, I don't like doing these things. Mm. I don't, I don't like superficial conversation. So I knew I just had to keep it real with them. And, and I'd say, I'd say, speaking about interesting people, I think that would kind of be a good transition to uh, my next clip. Um, it, it does relate to the, the Halloween episode. Nice. Um, we had some very, very interesting guests on the show. Um, we had a <laughs> hipster vampire. We actually had the purple imposter from oh. Among Us. And then we had um, a special I, – I, I mean, we all thought it was a, you know, a big-time celebrity, but I guess he was just from the, the knockoff versions of the movies. But we had Igor <laughs> from Frankenstein, and he easily stole the entire episode. He was hilarious. So here's a few highlights uh, oh. from – from the Halloween episode of Igor. So, so, so does Frank uh, have you have you working this Halloween, Igor? Or do you do you get any time off? Uh, mostly outside of Halloween. <laughs> I like to get Christmas off, and weekends is is, is pretty good. I, I could see I could see Doctor Frankenstein being really big on Christmas, just decorating his lab and all the little orbs of lightning. But I like it when he, he, he stuffs my stocking. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> How old are you, Igor? <laughs> I am 35. <laughs> Holy shit. I'm so sorry. I mean, no offense. I was wondering, does, does Dr. Frankenstein have a, like a, a benefits program for his employees? or? Yes. For every organ we donate, he punches our card when we donate... Ten organs, we get a free frozen yogurt. (laughs) How many organs do you have left in your body? At least. (laughs) (laughs) At least least two. (laughs) At least two, okay. (laughs) We got it. We did it. (laughs) We made it. We made it. Oh, God. (laughs) Igor, what's your go-to yogurt, by the way? Mmm, I love the strawberry yogurt, especially with the fresh strawberries. Okay, now, you, now I'm, start, I'm, I'm starting to like you less than purple. Yeah. But it has to be non-dairy. I'm lactose intolerant. Igor, I know this might not be something you can share with us, but if Franken's not listening right now, just give us a little hint. What's he working on right now? What's the next big project he's bubbling up? Well, you didn't hear this from me. But he's attempting to add two extra legs onto a dog so he can tap dance better. <laughs> oh, dang. <laughs> that guy's always solving the like, world's biggest problems. Is he going to be adding tap dancing into their brain, or is he just going to be making them sort of have more legs and then just seeing how they skitter around the house and stuff? Well, he's actually gotten the dogs from a special island where they specialize in tap dancing. So as you see... Uh, the training is not necessary, uh, such as the brilliance of Dr. Frankenstein. All right, I- Igor, there's so. another question that we got to, well, I'm going to paraphrase because um, as all literature nerds know, 
Frankenstein is the doctor's name, not the monster's name. You guys got a nickname for the monster? What do you guys call him around the office? The there office. are some who call him Tim. Tim? <laughs> <laughs> That was so anticlimactic. You just I know. <laughs> oh yes. Oh my god. Amazing. That's so I'm, good. I'm, you can't not Sam. laugh when you hear that. <laughs> There's some call him. Tim. <laughs> Sam did such a good job, man. I, I, I was just recording on my phone. And I had to mute myself during that episode because I was laughing so hard at some points and I didn't want to like drown out his performance just with my laughter because he was so damn good. Yeah. His improv was phenomenal. God. See, what's funny though, like when I was organizing the episode, I was like, what characters are you guys going to play? Are you going to do this, this? So Spade was like, well, I think I'm going to play like a, a vampire from like Wisconsin. I'm like, okay, that's kind of a weird character. I can see where that can go. And yeah. Corey didn't tell me what he was going to play until the day. So I didn't, but it's Corey. He's like, oh, whatever. You're good. And Sam, I didn't really know a lot about Sam. Sam's like, I'm going to play Igor. And I'm like, really? You're going to play the most fucking generic, yeah, generic character? Ass. Yeah. And, and he just fucking blew it out of the water. Like, Gosh. you take the most generic character and steal the show with him? Come on. Yeah. That is not Igor. That is an original Salmonot piece of gold right there. <laughs> also, Igor has my favorite line from any part of the Newgrounds podcast, which is this. Oh, I can feel my booty dance. Oh, I can feel my booty dance. Come on, yeah. remix that. It's ready for the remix. Yes. There you go. Yes. Remix. <laughs> <laughs> I love it when he goes. <laughs> <laughs> you know that's actually i know i know we don't have a clip of it but um after i came on with johnny um of I, f- I forget what episode it was it was just recently um we we started talking about salad fingers a little a little bit and i think it was maybe a week and a half later zin says in one of the chats like it's like, yo, Corey, that song that your voice got sampled in was dope, man. I'm like, what the f- I got sampled? What are you talking about? And there, there's a song on Newgrounds where it's me talking about, I, f- I think we're just talking about pickled fingers or something like that. Huh. Like the feeling of pick, like the feeling of rust on my pickled fingers <laughs> is almost orgasmic. And they took that, the they took that sample and they turned it into a fucking oh awesome God. song. When I when I found out about it, I listened to it, I messaged him, I'm like, this is an awesome track. Wow. Like I had no idea you did this. So <laughs> I, it, it's it's it was pretty surprising yeah. that someone thought I yeah. was sample worthy. They sampled <laughs> yeah. salad fingers, but they sampled you as salad fingers. <laughs> yeah, and they they referenced the NGP episode, and it got front page. It was a good song. Yeah, yeah. it was. It was really good. We could do the purple imposter one too if we wanted to, because we also have. Well, that. we're talking about it. We're talking Please. about it. Yeah, yeah, play it. Yeah. Play it. Purple imposter, let me throw a classic dating game question at you. If you were going to take me on a very romantic date, all the way from the beginning to the end, what would it be? (laughs) Hmm, that's a good question. I'd say first we start in the cafeteria, you know, (laughs) have ourselves a little pre-made dinner. Then I'll take you into admin, and then I'll help you swipe your card. And then the lights will go out. So then we'll go to an electric room to fix the lights. And then just when things are starting to feel most romantic, yeah. I'll stab you in your throat. Oh, <laughs> wow. Mm, <laughs> slip it in. Wow. Man, I'm really doing a good job of making sure this is romantic in my head. I'm imagining it as romantic and positive as possible. Oh, don't worry. But, I would hold your hand the entire time. Oh, that's so <laughs> nice. Oh, man, that sounds... And then I'll stroke your hair as you bleed out. It'll be so romantic. Oh, I love this. I love everything about this. I'm having such a good time right now. (laughs) That's all I want from you, Will, is just to have a good time in hell. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. That's great. Wow. How am I doing, guys? (laughs) Jesus Christ. (laughs) Talk about new experiences. Uh, Yeah. (laughs) You know something, Will? I'm Cute. still waiting for that date. No! <laughs> you never Will. called me, and my Damn. heart hurts. <laughs> Will physically started to get, like, uncomfortable, and I could tell. That was awesome. <laughs> I know. Howie! 
How are we doing, guys? <laughs> How are we doing? No, I was having a great time, but I was playing into it. Let's just say that. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it kind of reminds me, though. We did um, we did the announcement, or we did the whole playlist of the Among Us Jam that one time. It wasn't really a show. Yeah. That was another big event we did this year. I totally slipped my mind until now. Oh, oh my God! Was yeah. it? Wasn't that five hours long? And we all just six, six. fucking hours we long. We just walked. We had so many viewers that Discord couldn't support anymore. I had to start a Twitch stream. <laughs> it was fucking nuts. Yeah, I literally. Yeah, it was cool felt, actually because well, that was weird for me. Just like as an audience member, even because I saw you do it on the first hour, and I went up and like had an entire day. Like with my family. And then I came, I checked my phone like right before dinner, and the same goddamn event was still happening. You're still watching cartoons. Yeah. <laughs> so I was like, whoa. Well, and well, so many people watched the whole thing. They were they were with us all day. It was nuts. Yeah. It was so much fun. The live commentary was awesome. And we started off from the worst to the best. So so you get all these crappy ones, and it started getting better. Like we were all voting on the uh, ones that deserve better ratings. Jeez. And it was. It was really fucking fun, man. I'm glad I had the day off for that. Yeah. <laughs> it was really cool after that, too, because we interviewed the Among Us creators, right? And Amy was like, yeah, I was there for that. Yeah. yeah. I, I was in that stream watching the videos along with y'all, and I was kind of hoping that nobody would notice me, and it seemed like I kind of went under the radar. So cool. Hell <laughs> yeah. It's like, damn. And Tom Tom <laughs> was there, too. He even showed up for, for a bit of it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like he was it. pretty active. Actually. He was there for a lot of that thing, yeah. I, I, oh, like, actually, I love yeah. like movie watch along, show watch along, where we're in the chat roasting the movie or show to watch. Yeah. I think that's so like the room. the room. The room, the room was great. So La- Labyrinth, that. not so much. Labyrinth, Labyrinth I guess people just didn't like Labyrinth or something because they all left and played a game and were well, something. Here's the funny thing: they, they we had the Among Us rooms going still at that point, and that was the day they were supposed to close. Yeah, and fucking Ninja Muffin of all people, our mm-hmm. comrade. I'm glad I deleted him. <laughs> he fucking took he took the whole party with him to another server. Yeah, and to add insult to injury, it was my server. <laughs> yeah. We just sat there and watched Labyrinth by ourselves, like idiots. <laughs> but it was still good. <laughs> That was I feel awesome. great about that because I was the one that suggested Labyrinth. So yeah, feel, feel really I good love Labyrinth. Yeah. Though, man, it's such a good movie. It's a damn good yeah. movie. It is a good I movie. I stand by it one hundred percent. So I have some shorter ones that are uh, some of them are shorter, but like just these are from interviews because we're not the only funny people on Newgrounds. People who come in and talk about their game or their series or whatever they're doing. It's really funny to hear what's going on in their lives. So I was wondering if maybe I'll just play a couple of these. So, do you want to do you want to start with um, the frame makers one? Can we lead into it a yeah, little bit? Yeah, please go for it. Cool. So yeah, so Will, you and I had been talking about um, just you know a few things a little bit before we started the frame makers episode, and we had talked about the fact that you know they have that fray tools yeah. uh, that they're going to release along with the game, so that people can create user generated content and put it in the game. And I think it was you actually you brought up. <laughs> That you know, like, what if they just get like a bunch of like penis characters? What if all the characters? What if it's just like hundreds of? Of penises? course, I said that. So we, so we, yeah. So we asked them that on the air. We were like, "Yo, what if you get hundreds of penises?" <laughs> yeah. And uh, this, this was their response. Yeah, it's good, just going to have to be a case by case basis. Um, we haven't talked too much about the penis characters. <laughs> I, that's hard to believe. Wildly, yeah, frankly, I can think of like more wildly offensive things. Um, we'd probably have to do something if we got like a bunch of penises, penis assists. We'd have to stop them from like if like showing up. That's it. Yeah, it's short. They seem so just cavalier. Lots of penises. <laughs> Yeah. They're like, yeah, we might get lots of penises. <laughs> yeah. We, I mean, if you get we might off, have a bunch you make of a penises. Spin-off game. You just make a, an all penis game. Yeah. <laughs> penis fighting Dick game. <laughs> Dick 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 Dick. fighting game. When I asked that, I was so ready for them to be like f- super ready for it. And so I was like, what about the dick characters? And they'd be like, oh, don't worry. Like, we have a plan for the dick care. But instead, you heard that for a second, they're like, um. Well, yeah. We haven't talked about penises. <laughs> we haven't At first, penises. everybody who listened to that episode is going to make a dick character now. Of yeah. Course. Now we're the people. Well, we're the you problem. better. <laughs> <laughs> we are the problem, yes. Um, yeah. It honestly would be a disservice if we didn't draw dicks, you know? <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's what we're good at. You know, why yeah. don't we give our talent to the world? That's right. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's the Put it in the world. If, if <laughs> we're not... 
if we're not drawing dicks, then presumably we're being dicks. So we'd best get to drawing. Folks. That's true. Yes. Um, <laughs> Some of us can do both. <laughs> That's yeah. true. This is an official Newgrounds podcast, by the way. So <laughs> <laughs> That's right. So everyone knows. Dick Sanctioned 100% by Tom Fulp. Yeah, we Honestly. got our dick pass. We're good. <laughs> we're fucking good. We can do what we want. And that that was the Black Party's uh, theme. It was uh, draw dicks, don't be one. Yeah. So. Yep. Yeah. Um, I have take, the take that to the grave. The Dead Estate team, Milk Bar Lads, came on, and one fun one thing we found out about them is that they take their dev chat very seriously. By that I mean they put mostly Kanye dancing gifts and like just absolute nonsense. <laughs> in it. So this is <laughs> if you saw the dev chat, you would think we're about, we're all like six years old or something. You probably do right <laughs> yeah, now. Yeah, no, yeah, we we should post all the time. I uh, I keep posting my Kanye dancing gifts. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll go through the dev chat trying to look for shit like references that I posted in there that I didn't save on Clip Studio, and then I'll just see like a bunch of Kanye gifts, and I'm like, oh my god, you guys, please! I need because like we we have a dev server that has separate chats, one for just general chat, one for shit posting, and then one for actual development, and the other two never get used. All of the shit posting goes in the dev chat. It makes it very hard to follow. Yeah. I, I... I just looked yeah. in the dev chat and the first thing I saw was like a picture of a monkey with a funny t-shirt on. Like, <laughs> 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 nice. Wait, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh, sorry, that was, that was me. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, interviewing awesome, them though. was difficult because they're such good friends. They would get sidetrailed all the time, and then there'd be just eight minutes of them bullshitting and laughing their asses off. Yeah, it's like we got to do an actual fucking interview. <laughs> yeah, that, that's a lot can... like how the Satina episode was too. <laughs> they yeah. just be bullshit. Yeah, you can't you but... can't just talk about Kanye. That's, <laughs> that's not... I mean you can, but. But that's not why I'm interviewing you. <laughs> it's not like it. Yeah. See, I always, I always love those interviews though because it's, it's so much less work. As like, I, I'm not like Zen is a meticulous planner. Everybody, like, if you, if you don't know the guy, he has like, he makes lists. He has plans upon plans. Mm -hmm. He's got a plan B, C, D. And me, <laughs> me, I just show up. <laughs> you know. So, so we did Scum House. It was great. Well, Scum House is funny though because. We were supposed to interview Hans Van Harken, just Hans. And I was like, oh, great. He's a friend of mine, and I haven't talked to him in a long time. It'll be fun. And he's like, well, we're going to bring all these people on too because I'm part of this cartoon. So let, would it be cool if we brought them? We're like, yeah, that's fine. I don't know who they are. I've never heard of this project until now. But we brought them on, and it was like one of the best episodes I ever did. So, I mean, cool shit. Yeah. I have like – my last one, I just want to – Put a little silver lining on the Friday Night Funkin'. Friday Night Funkin' was hard for us because Craig died basically permanently during our interview, right? <laughs> so basically we did the interview and like 20 or maybe even 15 minutes into it, Craig goes away. Craig is our bot who records the episodes and we, she, he wouldn't come back. So this was an episode where we recorded for three hours and maybe got one hour of content and basically tried to get everybody recording on their own. And there was just this big in-between period. We were all just like, hello, darkness, my old friending it for about half of that. <laughs> but there was some fun stuff, especially near the end. I wanted to do this because I think we might have actually named the characters. This is exciting. With the names, uh, with the names, there's like these kind of <laughs> canon, non-canon. <laughs> At least Lewis is calling the girl. He's calling her Bertney. He's calling the girl Bertney. No, no, no. I, oh, I, I like that. No, Lewis asked, "What? well, what's her name? And I was like, Bertney. <laughs> B R T N E Y, <laughs> and he's like, okay, Aww. it's Bertney. Hey, I, I love like, Bertney. Lewis, Lewis awesome. is developing the lore. He, he's the uh, the fifth member of the team, basically. Now we just got to get a name for the main kid. Let's see. B F. Um, B -F. His name is Zinzinitz. <laughs> Gord. No. His name is. <laughs> his name is Gordy. No, we got. We got to ask Lewis. You said Gordy. Gordy. Gordy's I was thinking, cute. what's the worst? What's the worst name? <laughs> you Gordo. Could, uh, you could give him. <laughs> Lizzie McGuire, <laughs> Gordo, Gordo and Bertney. <laughs> the thing with all this, yeah. they're made for each other. My God, Gordo I'm... and Bertney forever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having Vietnam flashbacks to that fucking episode because once Craig shit out, everything just went to trash. It yeah, was, 
It was awful. And then we just got a bunch of shit posting. And, and then it lasted three hours. Yeah. There was a point where my mic muted for some reason. And I was trying to get everybody back on track and ask who was recording themselves. And I wasn't being heard. And everybody was still just bullshitting and talking. And I was like, did they just... Did they just give up and don't they, do they not care about me anymore? <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Yeah, we gave up on Will. <laughs> I was giving up on No, there was a point where I was like, is Will okay? He hasn't been back. It's been 45 <laughs> minutes. <laughs> he thought I was crying in the corner. <laughs> and, like, everyone from uh from the Friday Night Funkin' team was sleep deprived. So <laughs> we're all just, like, yeah. having the shittiest day. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to the New Grounds Podcast. We got to get through this. It's like Dark Souls. You just fucking yeah. just got to push yourself <laughs> through it. I love those guys. Yeah. But some dev teams might have been more, like, wholesome. Oh, that's okay. We can get through this. We'll record ourselves and it'll be all right. But I think Dave and Cam and Evil Skater were just kind of like, this is fucking hilarious. I'm going to let them, I'm going to let them burn for a little bit. Just, yeah. just, this is just funny. By the way, Cam left us to make Friday Night Funkin'. I know. Priorities? He made a mistake. He made a mistake. Can you yeah, imagine he if he That's, was still back Nobody's going to play that game. Yeah, nobody's going to play <laughs> yeah, that game. Yeah, literally every one of our episodes gets like 10 times the views that that game has. So. That's true. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. That game That game has reached, I think, 2 million views by now. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I think it, it might not be there yet, but it might be there. That, shout out to Cam. Shout out. That yeah, game was yeah. so big that even this server has a Friday Night Funkin' channel on it still, and it won't be deleted because it's a still active channel talking about that game. It's really oh, yeah, impressive true. that he, he did that after getting deleted, too. I don't know how he pulled that off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, God damn it. What's your favorite Cam moment? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> When he got when deleted. He got deleted. When he got yeah, deleted. <laughs> <laughs> Showed him, god damn it. <laughs> Is that all we got? Is that all the clips? That's we all fucking... I got. Yep. I yeah, wow. pretty much. A- anybody right, got any fun. memories left that they want to bring up before we end this thing? Actually, Will, good out. Uh what's it like seeing this podcast grow from day one? Like what were your day one expectation expectations and then what do they morph into now? Oof, yeah. You wanna go first? And do and do we need to apologize? <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I really had expectations. For me, it was like Little Box and I knew that ACOC was ending, and you know we had kind of entered into this talk. You know, the three of us about making a new podcast, but it was kind of all up in the air until Little Box was like, "Well, you know, actually, I got to go to college." So. Yeah. You do your thing. And, uh, and then that's when, you know, we brought all those other people on. I don't know that I had an expectation for it, but I think if I did, this has certainly exceeded it. Mm. I think that I've had a lot of really good times with this show. Like, you know, earlier us talking about the block party and stuff was really neat. I really liked that super cut that played earlier. Yeah. That was a very nostalgic moment for me, and I'm not going to cry, but I might cry a little bit. It's okay. It's okay if you do. Please do, actually. It'll be better. <laughs> It'll get us the listens. Yeah. We'll title the episode, Goodell Cries, everyone. Goodell Cries. I'm going to listen. <laughs> make, make, make sure you edit in some emotional music in the background. Here. Yeah. <laughs> no, just, just... Yeah. My God. This, this podcast, first of all, has taken many shapes and forms in the short life it's already had. It started as a couple of Cricket Patrol, kind of this mashup hybrid of the two podcasts we had. And then we had this big stable of people, and there was the era of like eight hosts, and everybody was just kind of like doing their thing. And some of it, like there were early episodes where I felt like everybody was talking about inside jokes that I didn't get. And I was like, I don't even know what's going on anymore. (laughs) But that was still good because, first of all, they're having fun. I, I like the guys and people are enjoying the show, and it's growing a little bit. So I'll say I don't know if I was expecting it to have the growth it had, and I definitely wasn't expecting it to look exactly like it does right now. Like, this is a this took many left turns into something really, really cool and very different than what I would have maybe thought. And I'm kind of glad that I didn't try to be like, no, it's this. Like, no, I, it, we want it to, we, the board of directors has decided it needs to be this, and that's it. And it's going to be like, no, like nobody's really operating that way. So this is awesome. And it's the way it is right now because of a lot of very talented and very creative people, namely us. No. (laughs) (laughs) Not to toot our own horns. Yeah. This this has been a wild ride and I'm happy to be on it. Very happy. 
Aww. Also, we made Newgrounds history. So we made Newgrounds while, history. While we're, while we're being like emotional and sincere for this brief moment before we uh, bring the community on to destroy it all. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I just want to say, um, for me personally, um, this whole podcast scene in general, uh, just going back to Grounds Patrol, um, listening to the first few episodes, like when Will first wanted to bring me on, just to talk about a goddamn forum post I made, uh, I started listening to bo- bo- both Grounds Patrol and I started listening to ACOC uh, just to kind of get an idea like who I was going to be talking to, whatnot. And, you know, from my perspective on Newgrounds, I've been working there for, God, what, what are years now? But fucking 20, 20, 13 years now I've been working for Newgrounds. And so I've, I, I joined Newgrounds. Well, I've been using Newgrounds since the late 90s. I joined it in like 2000, 2001, 2000. I don't remember. It's been a while. But, you know, I've, I've clearly been part of Newgrounds through multiple generations. And as an employee for even, you know, two, three generations as well. Um, and it got to the point where, you know, as a user, I kind of stopped being uh, active on the site. I stopped being uh, engaged in the community. Um, I think the last time I was even close to this engage was like when stickum was a thing and, you know, stickum chat and shit like that. And even then it was, it was not a group that I really identified a ton with, but it was, it was somebody to talk to, but, uh, yeah, you know, going into these podcasts and stuff and just like, even listening to that, that interview Will did with Twonix, you know, just hearing that there's people that actually, they're not just, you know, shit posting users all day. They appreciate like what Newgrounds is and, and, uh, not not calling me out directly, but it's just saying enough that they, how much they appreciate the work I do, and and that like kind of reinvigorated me. Like you guys have no idea uh, as as podcasters, like what you've done to reignite me, even Tom to a point, like just bringing us into like oh the community's actually really appreciative of what we do. They're not taking us for granted. You know everything we do matters and. And when you guys asked me to be a part of the podcast, you know, that was a kind of a really big deal because it was it was another place where I could come in and I could engage yes. with everybody and kind of find my place in the community again for the first time in a long time. And that like you guys, especially this year, like for me to be brought back into the community <laughs> yeah. in such a strong way, feel appreciated. And just have this thing that I'm a part of again, you know, not, not just the guy who builds new grounds and works on new grounds, but like I'm, I'm part of the new grounds community again. Yeah. And I feel that. And like, so thank you all so much. Um, everybody who does these podcasts, everybody who's been on these podcasts, the audience, you guys in the chat right now, mm-hmm. you know, like you guys have no idea what you've done to just reinvigorate me personally. This has been a really cool year for me. Like it's been a shit year for everybody. But professionally, it's it's been one of the best years of my career with Newgrounds. So uh, I'm holding my beer up now. You can't see it, but cheers. <laughs> cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you for real. What, I, what I'm hearing you say is that we did it. We saved Newgrounds. We saved Newgrounds. Yay. 2021, Flash is going <laughs> to die, but Newgrounds is alive, and it's all our doing. We did. And the goldfish's <laughs> heart grew three sizes that year. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Josh, you're the best. Thank you, man. Yeah. All right. <laughs> all right. Well, let's, all ki- right. let's kill this sincerity. Let's now. kill the sincerity. Let's get everybody coming <laughs> on. Zen, how would you like to do it? Is there a way yeah, you bef- were thinking you wanted bef- to do it? Yeah. Everyone in the chat, if you want to come on and say a couple words about your favorite moments of the Newgrounds podcast, go ahead. Go yeah. for it. I guess go say in the it. text first. And Who's we'll first? Uh, while, yeah. uh, while y'all are picking out who comes in first, I'm actually very late for something, so I do need to head out, unfortunately, but it's going to be Wait, do we want to... Well, um, that is so convenient. <laughs> oh, I got to leave when the community's... Co- Fuck you, Bill. <laughs> no. Hey, hey, says, says the guy that uh, yeah. left that review on the ACOT community talk that yeah. one time. <laughs> right. uh, Thank you, Goodell. <laughs> You're the best. Have fun yeah, with Yeah, Goodell. Goodell. I hope you I hope you're still doing all right, Goodell. I hope you're doing well, and I'm glad I'm you, glad Sam, you, you stopped by today to hang out. Yeah, yeah, me too. This has been a good time. All right, bye. I'll have a good ACOC community talk. <laughs> Later. Love you. <laughs> bye, Goodell. Bye, Goodell. All right, uh, Helv Helvy wants to come on yeah, yeah. <laughs> and talk about talk about his favorite episodes. Helv, 
Hello. Yeah, hey, yo. There he goes. There he goes. If you misspoken my name one more time, I'm gonna <laughs> eat your knees. <laughs> Wait, that's yeah. <laughs> Did you hear me? To, uh, is that gonna eat the, e, the E is silence and it's Halv Halv 11. It's Halv. Both, both Halv E's are 11. silent. Halv 11. <laughs> yes, it said, uh, Halv 11. It's that video game company, right? It's Valve? Valve. Right? Yeah. It's, yeah, Valve. Valve 12. They Valve make them 12. third life games? No. <laughs> what's up, Halv? <laughs> yeah, Halv. Yay, hey, what's up? Tell us your favorite episode. No. No. He said Perfect. no. <laughs> Perfect. I'm not gonna <laughs> tell my my favorite episode because I I like to participate from the podcast. I I don't actually listen to it. This is oh this God! Is... All right, get someone else in. Look, yeah. I, 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 yeah. look, I like, no, 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 no. Yeah. Let me let me... Yeah. <laughs> get him out of here! Get this <laughs> fucking guy out of here! This is why we like the new grounds podcast. He's Break back. his fucking knee. <laughs> Anybody else? All right. <laughs> <laughs> First round. This is so awesome. We'll do a, God, we'll do a few more. I love my community very much. Oh, but, I'm, cr- uh... I'm crying. <laughs> I'm fucking crying. Let's do snail pirate. All right. <laughs> yeah, it's snail, snail pirate. pirate. Snail What's pirate, snails? my boy. Oh yay! Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're only doing That's better. Than yay. Yay. Uh, all right. So uh, I guess I'll talk about my favorite moment. Um, nice. I have two. One was when I won. A- Cool plush. Uh, that was really cool. Mm-hmm. I liked when Zin said, uh, I like Snail Pirate. It made me feel warm and fuzzy inside. <laughs> uh, I, I kind of extracted that sound, sound bite and uh, play it on loop every time I go to sleep. That's nice. <laughs> and then, uh, my Swooning you to favorite, sleep. <laughs> yeah. My second mm-hmm. favorite moment is uh, the entirety of the uh, Milk Bar Lads episode. You know, because uh, guys, you should go play uh, Dead Estate. It's a very good game. Is Jack having a gun to your head right now? Like a blank one. <laughs> no, I love my boy Jack. Yeah. Jack is cool. Jack he doesn't is have cool. a gun to my head. <laughs> cool. Snail pirate, quickly hit the mute button twice if you're in trouble. He did. Uh-huh. uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> mm, I'm good. I'm fine. <laughs> oh. Th- thank you for coming out of the show, Snail Pirate. Yeah. Oh, thanks, babe. So- Fluffmutt says he can't come on the mic, but we all love him because he's a patron and also very fun, and we get to talk to him sometimes on the chat. Shout out, Fluffmutt. Yeah. Fluffmutt. You know. You know. Yeah, the creator of uh, text, text and Drive. Bull boy, you got a mic. I'm unmuting you. Get on here and talk to us. All right. What's your favorite NGP memory, Bull boy? Oh, you know, I have so many to choose from. Mm-hmm. He doesn't even uh, listen to the show either. <laughs> no, I got one. Oh, no. uh, and it's, a pretty, it's the, the impromptu one where you just unmuted the mics and everyone just blared their instruments all at once. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was in. That was yours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was fun, man. Yeah. I, uh, Bull Boy, what was your instrument? I forgot. I wasn't. You didn't unmute me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, do you, well, do you want to play now? something now? Yeah, you can make yeah, up you can, for it. No, nah, I don't have anything on currently. My my guitar is sitting in my friend's apartment. Do you want to play play nose kazoo or something? Can you sing? Uh, Maybe yeah. you can sing. <laughs> <laughs> there, right. you there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Do you feel better boy. now? Do you feel better now? <laughs> no, I'm more congested now. Good. Oh shit. <laughs> Nice. All right, all right, all right. All right I think it's, we're done with this. Year, I'm getting folks. a headache. This, this was a terrible ahead. idea. <laughs> thank you guys for showing up and hanging out. Yeah, thank you guys so much for uh, the year of Newgrounds podcast. It's been a weird year, but it's one that we've been able to be part of, and that makes us very happy. Uh, hey, thank you guys in the chat for being part of this, too. Uh, I want to. One of us should thank our patrons. Who has the list up? Who can get to it fastest? You ready? Oh, shoot. It's one, the, two, three, not, not it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Thanks to all our patrons. Each and every. You, uh, thank you. No, 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 no. Thank it, you. Right, and thank, thank you. Thank you. Patrons, Benny, otherwise known as Plifmock, Charissa Abinette, Boozle, Zachary Jones, and the man named Tom Fulp. He is our Lord and Savior. We all love him very, very much. And thank you to you guys. If you're listening to this right now, we love you more than anything, uh, except the other things we said just before this. And yeah, <laughs> keep listening. It's going to be a big year. We got more stuff on the docket, more interviews, more variety episodes, more comedy episodes. You all asked for it and you're going to get it. Here's to 2021. To 2021. Cheers. Happy New Year! Happy, Happy, New, Happy year. New Year! Thank you for listening to the New Grounds podcast. This show is recorded live on our Discord server. 
Join us at bit.ly slash NGP Discord. For the latest news, follow us on Twitter at the NG Podcast. Thank you to Waterflame for the use of his song, Gabberfly. Goodbye. <laughs>